Welcome back to Health Awareness YouTube channel. In this video, we share more light on the latest move in getting cure for the HIV virus. Here are the key highlights. Gilead's twice-yearly medicine to prevent HIV succeeded in a Phase 3 trial. None of the roughly 2,000 women in the trial who received the linacapavir shot contracted hive. Gilead needs to replicate the results in another Phase 3 trial before seeking FDA approval. The company expects to share more data later this year or early next year. If the results are positive, lenacapavir for PrEP could reach the market as soon as late 2025. Now, before we get into more details, don't forget to hit the subscribe button to stay updated on the latest news on HIV prevention and cure. Gilead's experimental twice yearly high prevention medication, lenacapavir, demonstrated 100 effectiveness in a late stage trial the company announced Thursday. In an interim analysis, none of the approximately 2,000 women in the trial who received the lenacapavir injection contracted HIE. This led the Independent Data Monitoring Committee to recommend that Gilead unblind the Phase 3 trial and offer treatment to all participants. Those who had not received the shot were given standard daily pills. These promising results bring Gilead closer to introducing a new form of pre-exposure prophylaxis, PrEP and expanding its high V business. Following the announcement, Gilead's shares rose by about seven. What the world needs is people to have more PrEP options so they can make the choice of the option that's going to work best for them, said Jared Baden, Gilead's Vice President of Clinical Development for HIV. Before seeking approval from the Food and Drug Administration, Gilead will need to replicate these results. The company plans to release data later this year or early next year from an ongoing Phase 3 study involving men who have sex with men. Positive results could see lenacapavir for PrEP brought to market as early as late 2025. More than a decade ago, Gilead's Truvada became the first approved PrEP for individuals at high risk of HIV. While daily pills dominate the market, drug makers are now developing longer-acting injections. PrEP reduces the risk of acquiring HIV from sex by 99 and from injected drug use by 74 when taken correctly. However, only about one-third of eligible individuals in the U.S. use PrEP, according to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. Health policymakers and advocates hope longer-acting options will reach individuals who cannot or prefer not to take a daily pill, thus better preventing the spread of HIV, which caused about 1 million new infections globally in 2022. It's really important to have more options than daily pills because the orals aren't going to get us to the end of the epidemic, said Bruce Richmond, founding executive director of the Nonprofit Prevention Access Campaign. We need to make sure that people have options to fit with their lifestyles. The FDA approved the first injectable PrEP, a pre in 2021. This drug, administered every two months, is used by about 11,000 people, according to its manufacturer, B. Eve. Tim Oliver, a 28-year-old public health worker in New York said he doesn't mind going to the doctor for his Apritude shots, but noted that some friends prefer daily pills over injections. A longer-acting option could appeal more to patients. RBC Capital Markets Analyst Brian Abrahams anticipates that Gilead's shot will significantly increase interest in preventive IV medicine, predicting peak sales of nearly $2 billion. Gilead's newer PrEP pill, Descovy generated around $2 billion in revenue last year. Activists have urged Gilead to ensure access to lenacapavir in low- and middle-income countries. The company has faced long-standing criticism over the price of its HIV medicines, with Descovy costing $26,000 annually. In its statement on the lenacapavir trial results, Gilead said it plans to update how it will address access in countries with high HIV incidence rates. Thanks for watching this episode. For more HIV news update, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, share with your friends and family, and turn on the notification bell. See you in our next video.